all right guys this is Rahil back with another video for cyphertech.com and in this video we'll be hooking up our components with routes so in a previous video we learned how we can build components in angular 2 in this video we'll see how we can display components and add routing to our application so before I begin I just want to let you know that I went ahead and created another component like we did for the home component I created an about component uh, with a simple template and a class a uh, few things I have done different uh, are different than what we did for the home component and this comes with TypeScript is that I'm uh, I'm strongly typing my property about me so next time if I assign for example an integer to this it should give me an error so the Visual Studio cries that number is not assignable so th this is one of the benefits of using TypeScript and the other thing is that we are uh, setting our property in constructor so in ES6 onwards uh, you can define constructors using the keyword constructor and whenever your component is initialized the con everything inside the con constructor gets executed alright so let's get routing so to add a route I'll create a file under the directory app app.routes.ts before I add any of the routes uh, one thing I need to show you is the setting of the base href so if you go to your index.html which I'm not able to find right now okay you'll see we are setting a base href so most of the uh, angular 2 application will have this this as the first child or the second child in your head this basically sets the base URL to use throughout your application so let's head back to app.routes.js so we'll be using the component router uh, provided by the angular 2 team and it is not a part of angular core and we'll have to import it separately so let's just go ahead and import from should be angular router okay it's giving me an error rather it should be the rate router and router module so your router configuration will be an array of an ob objects array of objects let's declare const I'm declaring it as constant because it's not gonna change and it will be of the type router let's make it so every uh, route takes in two minimum arguments one is the path and other is the component that it should load uh, for that path so let's just configure for our home component so uh, let's keep the path as home and loader home hang on why is it throwing out an error it is not assignable to the type router oops I think this should be routes yes should be routes yeah here you go so it's right now it's throwing an error because it says it cannot find home component well I think we won't need to add it over here since we'll be uh, declaring it in our module let's just see how it works out uh, in the meanwhile let me add another route as for our about component so 
so what will happen here now is whenever uh, and uh, notice that we aren't putting a slash over here because that that is what uh, angular 2 does for us so whenever we'll be at a path as um, your domain slash home it uh, angular 2 will look up for the home component and load it for us the last thing i need to do here is uh, pass this array of routes uh, to my for root function in the router module and export it so this line should do it for me now what we have to do is we have to import our route in our modules export routing from slash app dot routes and we'll have to inject it into our inputs we'll also have to declare it sorry we'll also have to declare our about component in the declarations which I missed out All right, let's see what we have by now. Okay, something broke. I think I'll have to add, import my components over here. So this should do it. But before we go, I think we'll have to also have to add an outlet to display our routes. So Angular uh, JS provides us. I'll just remove this selector. So Angular Router provides us with uh, a directive called as router link. Sorry, uh, router outlet. Just use that and should be an outlet. So whatever routes uh, components would be loaded. Uh, when uh, using a route it would be displayed between these two tags now the last piece of puzzle left is the navigation so what we want to do is whenever we click on home we need to navigate to the home component and similarly for the about for this uh, we have the router link for home it should be home Should be about so I think we are all set and our app should work now I'll just go to the home page first okay so what we are seeing here right now is the root component which says welcome to sci-fi app and if I click on home here you go uh, our URL is redirected to slash home and we have the home component displayed here and this this time is not coming from the selector instead it's coming from the router outlet so if I load click on about it should be welcome to about page hello I'm an about page application all right so that was the basic of the routing we have uh, there's more to the routing uh, probably passing in parameters and data etc etc will Right now we'll keep it simple and just close it on close it on this. In our future videos, we'll uh, make sure we uh, cover the router in depth. All right. Th until the next video, peace.